Yo, what's up, everybody? It's me, your boy, coming off of a spicy deck list. Today, we're gonna talk about uh, Blue Flare, as it's one of my favorite decks, or come to be my favorite deck in Digimon. Uh, this is a deck idea I had a while ago, trying to utilize the new or the upcoming Supreme Connection um, from the Machine Demon side um, of BT50. Um, that's why we are running for Kyria and Lennis, like most lists do. I'm opting to cut one Kyria to play one Yuya um, to ensure that we have a bl not a Black Tamer. Um, I am actually also down to cut a Wargamon to up the list in here, but you know, actually, I'm just gonna do that. This wasn't planned, but, anyways, uh, spicy one offs. Metagramon is just searchable. Um, I like it. I like him because he is a, a surprise answer. If there's like a Gramon on board and you evolve into him, and then you can play out one of your tamers for free, it's pretty nice. But besides that, uh, I will save changes and try to find a match. Um, there could be a lot of lot lot more to talk about regarding you know <laughs> the bandits that got uh, shown. On Monday, I hope also the music is not too loud. Um, I will try to provide such content a bit more. Usually, I do this on stream, but um, Digimon is not as well known, so uh, yeah. But uh, as I'm uh, showcasing the strengths of the uh, of the sim, real quick, uh, I just wanted to quickly mention for the people that actually just joined for Macman. Hi. I'm sorry that the the last video that I just posted was like a 15 minutes collage of me uh, singing. Uh, I don't think most people want to hear that in the sense of the people that came for me casting. Um, it's hard to find a match, so let me just ramble about a few other things. I could also just cut them down, but since uh, I am pretty busy with life uh, I don't have sadly the time to do so so I'm trying to do some light light-hearted videos so since I'm waiting for a match to queue um, I mean I would have talked about the, the sim but there's not not much news to that uh, let's just try to find a random guy um, the band list I mean hey <laughs> some people are mad I mean, I myself, I'm pretty sad about Anubis swing hit, but I'm happy that Mavamonda did not get hit uh, because it would have been pretty devastating for a lot more decks than just Anubis Moon. Uh, I mean, Garumon being hit is kind of obvious. I am amazed that they actually admitted to the failure. Not failure, but like everybody who who is aware of the new meta, uh, the meta in uh, JP with BT15 would uh would agree that Apicolomon is a problem and now we find a match and the Pokemon being hit on one <sighs> I mean I don't I didn't run it in my deck so I am Gucci but uh okay I think we keep this hand it's a pretty a bit greedy but playing playing them out for free with uh Mavodomon is fine. So yeah a Pokemon being hit to one it's kind of sad to see because I liked the uh, niche decks that Pokemon enabled. But then again, we saw Mirage Gargamon in the finals of EU. We don't want. Oh, sorry. My audio just cut. And we are facing Wookie Rush, which is. Oh, that's pretty nice. Uh, which is a bit of a problem, but um, we are gonna play down the uh, Metagramon allowing to uh, get the Mabor, uh, the Mabormon allowing to get the Kiran in it. Yeah, even if I'm not casting, I just don't read the card names. So, um, I don't need to talk about the the craziness of Ukumon and the annoyance that this deck provides 
to my heart especially now seeing rookie rush but i'm happy for the people that actually enjoy this kind of playstyle i mean i'm playing blue so i shouldn't be complaining but yeah um i'm looking forward to do a bit more content like this just lighthearted content um trying maybe even upload daily and that is gonna be me being choked to one so i will race i go to free um i can't reduce evolution which is fine i guess i will swing into the security draw one <laughs> and we find the cards that we just needed so he dies we will play out the Gremon for free revealing top four i will take him and i will take him and i will just bottom deck the blazing memory boost i will go swing with him too and uh, yeah uh, i mean i would want to let's let's just overlay right so we go we are going into metagamon for free um stunning uh, this one this one and this one or uh, a stunt we let him know and then your turn so if you want to swing with ukumon that is fine to me uh Yeah, that's that's fine to me if he really wants to swing with Ukumon, um, which I doubt. So he's going in for the swing. Checks one card and, ladies and gentlemen, as if this would have been staged, uh, I can reveal the top five cards. I will take the Metagram one. I will drop the Melbourne one, and make sure that we're gonna get good draws next turn so this is why i like supreme connection supreme connection enabling ah. there we have what so he chooses to So it's one, two, three, four, five. So this would be, I mean, it's okay. We, we are fine, right? We will go to free. We just uh, do what we are known to do. Digi cross for free. Um, but the question is what or do I really want to use? Uh, I will use the delay. Using delay. And I will use uh, this one and this one to play him out. Yeah, the the the, the thing is bugged. I will stun him, him, and him. Right? Yeah, I would really want to. So I'm going in for two checks. Uh, Stunning Gotsu and on play you may move on level three reading area to the better. Wow, that is alright. So
So there is that. Um, let's see. I mean, do I really want to give him a lot of memory? Like he has only two swings. Uh, I guess not. So I'm gonna play down him. I would take the Metagram on Cyber Launch and him, but I'm decking the rest, giving him give it over. So yeah. Uh. I forgot what actually uh, I was talking about earlier. But it's it's fine, it's fine. I, I try to do short kind of uh, content in the near future. And uh, yeah, I think opponent forgot that only Ukmon can swing, which is fine. Uh, Ukmon will die. I think he's allowed to draw. For each. Alright, he left. Uh, I'm leaving. It's fine. I will just keep this as a short video. 11 minutes is fine without editing. Um, yeah, I will try to release short content like this a bit more. Maybe with a structure. And if not, we're just gonna see some funny decks. But that's fun deck ideas. I got a bit more cooking up and probably also with different kind of content like uh Home terror which i can play pretty much on autopilot so i can talk a bit more about other topics but yeah uh coming back to this list um red flare i mean it's red because of magic Manic antibody in it but i didn't find him the idea of the deck is again utilizing the supreme connection trying to cheat out a magic for free i mean you want to play it sometimes to get a good search because it will reveal the top five set up your trash a bit sorry set up sets up your trash and you know gives you info i mean it also gives the opponent info but uh making sure that the next three cards that you draw are at least in the order that you want is to me a bit valuable i mean that's the only one for game if it's ever needed i had it i had him in because I had also the Wargram one. I just cut the Wargram at the beginning of the video for one Supreme Connection more. Um, I think also he is cuttable. Uh, now, that, now to think of, like I would just cut him. Maybe add the, uh, the amount of Greymons to be more specific, um, more aggressive. I mean, I, I like this. I mean, it didn't come up in this game because I faced Rush. Um, maybe I would just... Um, Record a second session and upload it tomorrow, so there's gonna be a bit more content. So this is probably why the music is still playing in the background. But yeah, uh, if you like this kind of content, uh, give me some, give me some love, show, give me a like, write a comment, and if not, if you didn't like it, also write a comment. And if you really did not like it, give it a dislike. It's no problem. But yeah, that's me. Um, probably recording another session and uh, peace.